Hello guys, we meet again. This is a new Blender 3D series tutorial that will show you how to create a simple house with only one floor. And this is my first part of the series, which is I'm gonna show you how to model the wall. But first, we, we need to prepare our layout scene here by set the dimension to metric by go to scene tab here, icon here, and change the unit to metric. And then next, we need to change the display of the... <coughs> grid i'm sorry as you can see i in this grid i have 15 lines so i want to add more lines so change to 30 maybe now it's bigger a bigger space to draw or model our simple house and then i change my subdimension to 5 this mean in one big in one big grid there are five small grid but you can see it now it's not too clear we can change by go to user preference click 3d view and change your grid to Change the grid color, maybe a little bit dark, like here. Okay, now you can see Piggy on front. Oh. Now you can see the grid will have in what this is this is a big grid that have one two three four five grid that's the mean of subdivision grid here okay now we will start to modeling the wall by Maybe we can use this cube and go to face. We can, I'm gonna erase this face because I only need one face. This face. And now we will add the we will change the dimension dimension I want my I want wait to be I'm gonna see. I'm going to move this to x5, oh sorry, x and one change the location to one so it sit right on x axis here like this and now i want to change the dimension why because the height of our wall may be four or oh, 
He's still hiding again. Now we have the height is three meter here. I want the wall, this side of the wall have five meter. The length is six. Let's make it six meter. So I'm just I'm sorry. Oh. I'm gonna change the x here six and go to edit mode and choose this edges and I'm gonna extrude to Y axis and I want to have 5 meter sorry extrude five in this in this direction and then I'm gonna extrude again so maybe like this and six and six and then I'm gonna extrude again why and I want to have five meter again and then I'm gonna I want this is a say same length as this edge so I'm gonna add this Just go here and now it will same with this part of the edges and then just gonna extrude again and now this okay now we have our simple wall here I'm sure we create double vertices so we need to select move to this mode and select all tools and remove double here so we don't have okay double edges or double vertex and for thickness we can use solidify modifiers but First, you need to erase all the transformation pattern that we did before. <coughs> As you can, if you remember, our first object is just a plane. And then we apply extrude tool feature. But now we need to erase all the pattern that we did by click on the object here and control a and choose rotation and scale and now we can apply we can add solidify modifier by click here look for solidify modifier and on thickness here we can I want to maybe 15 centimeter and offset zero just set the offset zero 
and make sure you check the even thickness here like this what if you want to add another side of wall after you apply the solidify modifier you can do that by go to edit mode and then choose add make sure you're in edge mode and choose let's say this edges this edge one edge and you need to first you need to duplicate the edge and you right click on your mouse so this the edge is stay on its original place like shift d and right click like this and now you can apply the extrude to y like this one let's say maybe like this you can select this edge again and shift D and extrude and move to X axis oh sorry extrude and move to x axis like this and maybe three meter like now now you have three new i mean two new wall okay i think for the how to create the wall in 3d this is it and next video I'm gonna show you how to create a hole on a hole on wall to place our door and our windows make sure you subscribe and see you soon bye